We'll now show how we can use the LogoPress 3 part nesting function to nest these three cutting punches into a wire block assembly. We'll set it to in a sheet and we'll set our space between the parts and also how far from the edge of the block. Then I'll select compute. It'll go through and find the best material usage. I'll select stop. If this is not what we want, we can go back and set parameters again, such as changing the angle increments to 90 degrees. Select compute again. Select stop again. If this is what we want, we check OK and give the wire block assembly a name. Select save and it'll create the wire block assembly and also give us an information note as we can see right here.